Well, I woke up this morning and looked at my phone and I had a message. I didn't quite catch right from where it looked like YouTube. I'm on Android, so you, know, you swipe from top down, it tells you different messages and whatnot. Um, so I noticed uh, MCE Buddy 2.4.8 is out, which is nice, knowing that um, they're still taking care of uh, upgrading, looking at things. Yeah, verse. I mean, the software works, don't get me wrong. I, I haven't had any need for anything. Um, so I just wanted to show you uh, that we're going to go ahead and go to the new version. So it says here, if you have a previous version, uh, MCE Buddy, cancel this installation and perform the following. Stop MCE Buddy, close the application, uninstall. Notes about up, uh, of upgrading. If you're upgrading from 2.2.3 or newer, I'm on 2.4.6. Uh, MCE Buddy preserves pretty much everything. Okay? And it says down here, com skip. You know, it also tells you where it keeps it. So, I'm not worried about backing up stuff. I'll trust them. Known, known limitations. We're not installing it on a Windows server. We're installing Windows 10. Uh, you need to have MKV splitter. So, I don't record in that format. I really don't use a lot of features. I'd like to actually get into it more, and I might have to. Because I've actually been recording... Well, I was recording a lot. Uh, I'm now doing over the air in addition to cable TV. I'd like to get rid of cable, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. So anyway, so change log. Here's some of the things that were added. Some of the options, bug fixes. Um, I looked through them. Really, for me, I'm not even sure if any of them will really affect me. Enhancements. Uh, let's see. Allow up to eight digits for season episode. Uh, I really don't see much even in here. Added HD Home Run H.265 profile. I'll have to look into that because I'm using the HD Home Runs, uh, the Quattro, the Connect Quattro over the air, and the HD Home Run Prime. Allow up to 50 maximum concurrent conversions. Wow, <laughs> I'm not doing that. Optimize Com Skip performance. Okay, so Com Skip. I was just using the f the free version that came with. Um, <clears throat> with uh, MCE Buddy and I don't know if you saw it in the forums it was taking me about 9 hours to convert I think it was a 1 hour show or maybe a 2 hour show still it's a lot of time I went and I donated for ComSkip it was like 10 bucks and it takes like next to nothing which you'll see in a minute because I'll actually show you some history so um, 2.4.7 I didn't even know there was a 2.4.7 so anyway Let's go ahead and get to it. Um, I'll show you MCE Buddy right now. If you didn't see my other one, my other videos. So I was using EPG data from Zap Zap to it, and I did not know that it was not recording. Uh, the data was blank, and I had to update, and had a lot of issues. So I got rid of that, and unfor well, unfortunately, yeah, I tried to do it cheap, but like we all do. But um, I ended up paying for Schedules Direct. It's $25 a year, and it just worked. It worked without any issue, straight into Next PVR, which is what I'm using for my DVR app. Now, I think uh, somewhere around here is where is where that broke. So I stopped recording. And once I got it going again, as you see, SpongeBob, Lucifer, Blaze, Henry Dangers. So things are going once again so as you see oh and yeah my task name is Plex look at the times oh that one's in that oh, this is a big show I gotta stop the reoccurring um, recording on this I just delete them because we don't even really use them my wife doesn't watch them uh, Henry Danger this was five seconds to convert okay um, so that's a quick quick overlook here you go SWAT took 42 minutes all right, let's go ahead. Uh, let's open that file back up. So from what I remember, it just said, if you have previous version, just uninstall it. Okay. Um, also, I'll show you real quick. Po post up in the comments what settings you're using, what you found works really good on conversion. I'd like to hear about it. Come on. Trying to get the settings to come up. Alright. 
So this is the only one I have. And when we look at the settings, this is general settings. Oh, click here. I've, it's been a while since I've been in here. I'm trying to figure out. Uh, delete manually, add original system settings. No. Oh, I think we got to click change here. Yes, okay. Let's hide that. Bring us down. So, yes, com skip. There's a location. I do DivX AVI normal. Uh, it works for me. Um, there's the HD home run. I might have to give one of them a whirl and check it out. There's other profiles. I'd love to hear what profiles people are using. Um, it'd be nice to know. And I'm doing just 720. I mean, I don't need super high def. The biggest TV I have is 46 inch Samsung. It's not a biggie to me. Uh, just type this just in case because I know I changed my password the other day. Make sure I did it in here. Okay. So let's go ahead and give us a let's give us a go. It's, Okay, I thought we could right click and exit. Um, if we close from the corner. <laughs> All right, that's an odd one. Close. Ah, okay, just gotta hit that close button, not the uh, X. And the remote client. I have no idea what it is. I didn't install it uh, on the last version. So, like I said, I really didn't get into a lot of this so let's go ahead and install well probably should uninstall first all right so let's do two things one we'll just extract that here um, C drive. Oh, and I record everything to here. So as you can see, you see you can see the files: 800 meg, 1.7 gig. So they definitely come down with the DivX AVI. All right, let's. Uh, no, look at that. Okay, it's a true 64-bit app. All right. So here's this. I'm just going to copy this just in case. I like being cautious. Oh, 1.75 gig, okay. Wonder how big the logs. There's the biggie of it. Oh, because I had backup logs. And they're pretty big files. All right, let's let this go. Come on. I really don't mess with this machine much. I just remote in occasionally. Okay, so yeah, I'm typically a scroller, just go looking. But at Windows 10 at the top, you can type it, start typing, it'll be there. So it's uninstall, which, okay, that finished copying, thank goodness. I gotta get to the doctor, so I'm trying to rush through this, get this video done.
not much of a talker when things are going. So I'm going to pause this, let this uninstall, and we'll fire it off for the installer. Alright, so this is the first thing that came up. Alright, so uninstalled. This is our backup folder. 1.7 gig, well, 1.82. Alright, so let's go in here. Let's try this again. Alright, next. Alright, cancel this, stop, uninstall, which we did. Next, agree. Everyone, what was that? This cost, that's fine. Alright, next, and it's installing. Says it's successfully installed. Let's go ahead and fire it up. Rest your mouse on any button box or item to get instant help. Okay. Let's set getting started. Okay. 2.4.8. Let's go into settings. Alright, still has it. It's good. Change. Comp, skip, plex. Yep, everything is here. Nice. Nothing really to play around with here. Alright. Cancel. Hit start. Okay, it's up and running. So. Let's go ahead, see what's on right now. Uh, it's all over the air. I'm just going to delete this, it really doesn't matter what we do. Go down there anyway, just a cable. All right. Inside edition. All right, we'll take this so we won't get much time. So record. Record once. Say OK. All right, we're recording it. I'm going to go ahead and let it record. And we'll see what does MCE Buddy do. And we'll take it from there. And we'll be back. Okay, we're back. Let's give us a check. So, this should be done. Um, looks like I got something scheduled for 10 recording. Let's see what we got. Uh, recordings. Pending. Today. Uh, home and family again. Update cancel. I don't want this. Alright, cancel that. I got more home and family. I just got a reoccurring. Here we go. Uh, hmm. I don't know which one it is. Okay. Anyway, let's get back to what we were doing. All right. So MCE buddy, I see nothing here. All right. I know it was a small file. Four seconds. Okay. Well. Let's take a look inside dot edition. Interesting. Season 30. All right. So I don't, like I said, I have to go through MCE Buddy and I got to reset it because I don't like it named like this. I like it where it would be inside space edition and then it would be inside space edition season 30 and inside there it would be inside edition so s30 e98 and then the actual episode whatever if it had a title to it um 
kind of like, let's see how Henry Danger came out. See how this comes out like this? And what happens is I end up coming in here and I end up renaming them with the FileBot utility. More so like this. So that way we have it. Alright, so the file is here. It worked. Uh, let's go to Plex. Alright, uh, let's see. Here it is. Go in. Alright, it's got the name to it. Alright. Let's, let's hit play. Now, this is through a team viewer session, so. Alright. Looks good. I don't hear. Alright, let's do this. Sorry, I'm congested. I keep pausing. All right. My server is unavailable. Why is that? It's up. It's right here. All right. Try again. Interesting. Yeah, it'll be up. It'll be up for weeks and months. And once I go to toy with something and little stuff happens. Come on. I clicked it, not coming up. Do. We're going to reboot. Alright, so we'll be right back. Well, while I was waiting for the uh, Plex machine to reboot, I went through and was cleaning up files and <laughs> totally forgetting that I just recorded that video for us to take a look at. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back here. I'm going to head to the doctor's. i got to leave in two minutes. So, what we're going to do is we're going to record something else and let it do its thing a full length. If we hurry up, come on, my machine's running a wee bit slow, alright, let's look at the TV guide, what do we have, uh, let's take a look, let's see where's anything I really feel like grabbing, Let's go to cable. Oh. Hey now. Alright. Probably nothing I really care to keep. Nothing on sport. Da, da, da. Gotta hurry up. Got one minute to really get a full show. So, you know what we'll do? We'll just grab fixture upper. Quick record. Alright. So, this will start recording very soon. It's a one hour show. So, we'll take back over and we'll check it out in Plex. We'll look at the file size and how long it took again. Alright, we'll be back. Okay, back from the doctors and stopped at Chinese Buffet on the way. Oh, so much MSG, it's awesome. All right, let's try and remember where we were. Uh, yeah, that's right, we recorded a show. I don't got something else being recorded today. Take a quick look. Uh, today, 2.30, SpongeBob. All right, so let's get out of here. All right, so let's bring up Plex as it thinks about it. Come on. 
Oh. All right, let's go back to here. All right, so MCE buddy. Do not see it down there. We'll launch it. History. Fix your upper. Done. Took 37 minutes. Okay. Let's take a look. Uh huh. Uh, because I reboot, my map drive does that. I bet you it didn't copy. Uh, it did copy. Uh, interesting. All right. I took because I provide the password within MCE, buddy. Um. So here we go. Here's the file. Curious. Something I was thinking about earlier. 720 by 400. Okay, so it is. The reason why I say that is that the file I had earlier, that short one that I deleted, I think it was Insider or whatever, um, inside it said 1080i. 1080p? I forget. All right, anyway. Focus. Ah. Let's launch a new edge. Okay. Should show up right on the front page. Recently added. Insider edition. Um, TV shows. Alright, fixer upper. Huh, not here. Why not? It is here. Season three. All right, let's do a scan. Should fall right in between these two. And it is sitting in TV series, so. There we go, okay, Plex just didn't inventory in yet. So we'll give it a minute, let it do its thing, get the cover, get the info. There we go. It's got the cover. Let's go inside. HGTV. More. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it looks good. All right. So, I mean, that was a little bit more than just MCU, buddy. It was kind of just running through, making sure files... Yeah, stuff got recorded, stuff got changed. Um, one thing I am going to do is, like I said, I got to get into the settings on this thing. I think you got to pause it before it let you in settings. But I want to get this renaming piece down because I don't like this. If you have any tips on that, you can let me know. Just plop them in the comments. Uh, take a look at that. Come on. All right. So here's my job. Change. All right. Rename and sort by video information. Custom, enable custom file rename. I bet it's going to be this guy here. Um, percent TV show, show name, season. Aha, yep. That's exactly what I want. So. I'm going to go run through this and I'll play around with that. Maybe I'll figure out more about options when I'll do up another video at some other time. It won't be for a little while. It'll be in a while. I still got my truck to work on. It's getting a little nice out. So, all right, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Well, this is just how I am. I can't let things sit still. So, with that, I went in MCE, buddy. Paused. Settings. Opened up the conver conversion task I have. Came down. It was enable custom file name. So I did percent show name percent. Which is cool because it shows you down here what it's going to be. So title slash show name percent show name percent space. Got to put the space. Whatever you put here is how it will be here. Um, as an example, if I back this out, see how it backed out? Title season are now joined. Um, and then title and then subtitle. So I went through, I did that, and I went into my recorded folder, and 
drag dropped it in this window and reconvert it. So let's take a look. So I guess Inside Edition has a period in it. So we'll go ahead, we'll open it. Now while I was playing around, I didn't have a space here. I also had a percent space season in another spot. So you literally have to be thorough and look it over. But the final one, let's go ahead and delete this one. The final one is this, Inside Edition Season 30. Inside Edition S30E98. Um, there was no title behind it, so I'm not quite sure why. Um, I do know if we open up the log file. Give that a minute. Ah, that was quick. All right. So we go all the way to the bottom at least. Um, so we come up here. Cannot find the episode name. So I'm not too sure why on that. Um, like I said, I gotta look into things. I gotta learn more about how this works. I'd like to get it get it figured out. But it actually went from there to here. So it worked. Um, I'm happy with it. So, all right. Thanks.